The Detroit Lions 4-6 are preparing to host the Houston Texans 3-7 for their annual Thanksgiving Day game, and because it's a Thursday game, the team injury reports will be released on Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday this week. After yesterday's game, the Lions did not hold a full practice today, so the injuries listed are best guesses from coaches and not based on today's performances. Here's a look at the Lions' full injury report, with the updated changes in injury status. Swift is still in the league's concussion protocol and it's not exactly clear how far along he is. If he were able to pass a workout regimen, then he would still have to make it through Tuesday's practice in a non-contact capacity, then through Wednesday's practice as a full-contact player. He would then have to be medically cleared by an independent doctor to be available for Thursday's game. Amendola missed all of last week with a hip injury and after being estimated as unlikely to have practiced today does not bode well for his availability on Thursday. It's still early but not off to a great start. Han's health is headed in the wrong direction. After being added to the injury report in the middle of last week, Han looked like he had a chance to play on Sunday. Unfortunately, he was downgraded on Saturday and is now estimated to not have practiced today as well. Not a great start to the week. Okuda was injured in yesterday's game and was forced to leave the contest early. He has shown the ability to bounce back quickly from other injuries this year, but a short week complicates things. Ford is in the same boat as Swift and will need to pass through all of the league's protocols on a short week. He was also injured in yesterday's game during a special teams play. Stafford, Hawkinson, Vitae, Davis, and Jones were all on the injury report last week but were able to play last Sunday. Vitae was the only one in this group that left the game early, but it's unclear if this was injury-related or a benching. Galladay and Bryant are being upgraded in this estimated scenario, which is very positive news for their progress. If Galladay is able to play on Thursday, it would be a massive upgrade for the Lions' offense. Hall, Jackson, Ragland, and Harris are all new additions to the injury report. The fact that they were listed as listed instead of did not practice is a good sign for their availability.